hi everyone welcome to my channel in this video we are going to solve this uh, nice integral we are going to find the approximate value so approximating sink integral so how to begin okay first uh, here we have sine of x so i am going to use uh, Bhaskara approximation of uh, sine of x this is the identity sine of x uh, is approximately equal to 16 times pi minus x times x over 5 times pi square minus 4 times pi minus x times x so this identity this formula uh, works for uh, x great, uh, greater than to 0 and uh, lower than or equal to pi and here uh, angles uh, measured by uh, radians okay uh, let's look at the graph of sine of x and uh, this function now uh, our integral integral from 0 to 5 over 2 sine of x over x dx i'm going to take this is equal to i so we can write now uh, i is uh, approximately equal to integral from 0 to pi over 2 now instead of sine of x we have uh, 16 times pi minus x times x but here we have x so we know x get cancelled so in the denominator we have 5 times pi square minus 4 times pi minus x times x dx okay then uh, we know this is uh, approximately equal to integral from 0 to pi over 2 now i am going to rearrange the numerator uh, like here we have 16 times pi so i am going to write 8 times pi minus uh, then 16 times x minus 8 times pi now we know uh, 8 times pi here minus minus plus 8 times pi we have 16 times pi uh, minus 16 times x okay then uh, in the denominator we have uh, same function 5 times 5 square minus uh, 4 times uh, now we can simplify pi x now minus minus plus so plus 4 times x square dx well uh, now we can split this integral into two different integrals so we can write uh, this is approximately equal to integral from 0 to pi over 2 now 8 times pi over uh, this function so here we know 8 times pi is a constant so we can write outside of the integral sign here 8 times pi and here we have uh, dx over 5 times uh, pi square minus 4 times pi x plus 4 times x square and then here we have uh, minus 16 8 uh, so i am going to take minus 2 as a common factor so 0 to uh, 5 over 2 now here we have 8 times x 8 times x minus 4 times pi over 4 times uh, x square 4 times x square minus 4 times pi x plus 5 times phi square dx okay then um, here uh, 8 times pi 8 times uh, pi integral from 0 to pi over 2 uh, dx over uh, now i am going to write uh, this function as a uh, perfect x square so here 2 times x uh, 4 times x square we can take 2 times x minus 5 perfect x square so if we simplify 4 times x square minus uh, 4 times pi x plus 5 square so uh, we should uh, subtract 5 square and here 5 times 5 square so we have 4 times 5 square uh, and here we have uh, minus 2 times now if we differentiate the denominator we know 8 times x minus 4 times 5 so derivative of the denominator replacing the numerator so we know this is equal to natural log of uh, 4 times x square minus 4 times pi x plus 5 times pi square from 0 to pi over 2 okay then uh, here we know this integral arc tan so here 8 times pi times 1 over a a we know uh, 2 times pi uh, so 
2 times pi and here uh, coefficient of the function variable uh, we know uh, 2 so we should divide it by 2 uh, and we know this is equal to arc tan of x over a x we know 2x minus pi a we know 2 times pi uh, limit we know 0 to pi over 2 limit 0 to pi over 2 and here now if we apply limit uh, we know minus 2 times uh, now uh, upper bound phi over 2 uh, so 4 times phi square over 4 minus 4 times uh, phi uh, x phi over 2 so phi square over 2 plus 5 times uh, phi square uh, sorry here natural log uh, so natural log here natural log I'm sorry uh, I'm going to write natural log uh, then minus uh, we should apply uh, lower limit so here again natural log uh, 5 times pi square sorry uh, i edited the video uh, because uh, you know uh, i recorded the video by using my mobile phone so uh, suddenly i received an uh, urgent call uh, okay let's start so uh, now here we have uh, natural log of 5 times pi square and now we can simplify uh, we know this pi get cancelled 2 times 2 4 and here 8 so we have here 2 uh, so we can write uh, now um, i uh, here not equal sign approximately equal to so we know approximately equal to uh, now here we have 2 times 2 times uh, now here if we apply boundary uh, boundaries we know uh, phi over 2 uh, so 2 get cancelled phi minus phi is 0 so we have 2 times uh, 0 uh, then minus uh, if we apply lower bound we know minus phi over 2 times pi pi get cancelled minus 1 half uh, but this minus sign we can take in front of the arctan so here plus uh, arctan of arctan of 1 half arc tan of one half uh, then sorry then here uh, we have uh, minus 2 minus 2 then uh, natural log of here if we simplify uh, we know 4 get cancel uh, 2 times here 2 so 6 times 5 square minus 2 times 5 square 4 times 5 square so 4 times 5 square uh, then here natural log of 5 times phi square okay then uh, here we have uh, 2 times arc tan of uh, 1 half uh, minus 2 minus 2 uh, natural log of uh, so according to property of natural log we can write uh, this is equal to uh, here uh, uh, minus sign we can take as a factor so here plus 2 then we have natural log of 5 times 5 square minus 4 times 5 square so according to property of natural log we can write natural log of 5 times 5 is square over 4 times 5 is square 5 square get cancelled so 2 times natural log of 5 over 4 and uh, approximate value of uh, this identity we know 1.37 Three. Okay, uh, thank you for watching.